What's going on everybody? It's your boy Range Plays back again with another CSGO skins video. In today's video we're going to be talking about CS2 and whether or not you should sell your skins, buy skins, or what you should really do right now. As most of us know, the market has inflated ever since CS2 was announced, and especially in Doppler skins and skins that have a lot of shine to them or look relatively good already in CS2. But I'm here to tell you right now that just because a skin looks good right now in CS2 does not mean it's worth the overpay that people are charging for it. And because of that, I'm also going to let you know that if a, st if a skin looks terrible right now in CS2, or you don't like the look of a skin right now in CS2, and you're seeing it drop in the market, but you like how that skin looks in CSGO, go pick it up right now. Because if you pick that skin up right now, they will... For sure, change it in CS2 to make it look better. Remember, CS2 is an open beta right now. Or closed beta, sorry. CS2 is a beta. They have not confirmed that this is what the end game of these skins will look like. They haven't even confirmed that the skins that everyone loves the look of are going to look the exact same when the game releases. So, if you're freaking out right now, going, should I sell my Doppler? Dopplers are at an all-time high. If you bought that Doppler because you love the look of it, and that is exactly the skin that you wanted, don't sell. Keep that skin. That is yours. You did whatever you had to do to get to that play skin, and unless you have a knife that is, like... Something else that you want that's much cheaper. Like we're talking $300, $400 cheaper. But you would be okay dropping down to that knife? Then go for it. Me personally, I'm a big, big fan of the Tiger Tooth knives. The Tiger Tooth knives, when CS2 was first announced, everyone was hating on them. And we saw some price drops because of it. Luckily, I held on to mine because the prices seemed to be stabilizing out again. But... Here's the thing about it. When CS2 first drops, the prices are going to be jacked one side or the other. They're either going to go way up or way down. We can't really tell right now. We don't know. But I will be able to tell you this wholeheartedly that the market will stabilize out. Skins that should be worth $10 to $15 will still be worth $10 to $15. I don't think that you guys will see much more of a price hike than maybe a few hundred dollars on some of the most expensive skins in the game. And that won't even be due to CS2. It'll just be due to some of those skins getting older, more rare, things like that. You see it all the time. There are skins that in 2016 would have cost you 50 bucks. And now, just because they have some rare sticker or a rare float or a rare pattern index, are going for hundreds or even maybe thousands more than what they could have gone for you know just a few short years ago so my biggest takeaway here is don't stress about this it's gonna be okay your inventory is not going to all of a sudden disappear overnight because cs2 is being released the only thing that you stand to lose is a few hundred dollars by not selling and then buying when the prices are low again and if that is something that you want to do and you believe that the market is going to go way up you can sell dump your skins and then it's going to crash again then go for it but me personally i feel like the market's going to go up 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 and then it's going to start to go back down to where it originally was and it may take you know a few months from cs2's release but i don't see these skins just continuing this meteoric rise upwards and we're already seeing some of it these skins went up 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 and then all of a sudden started to slowly dip back down the hype around cs2 is bringing a lot more people into this game a lot more people are playing and that means a lot more cases are being opened a lot more skins are being pushed into the marketplace right now so just be aware of those types of things when you guys are looking at skins or you want to buy skins. Right now is an amazing time to buy because there's so many skins. Now, I'm not talking about amazing time to buy the high tier skins. It's not. Right now is a terrible time to buy the high, ten sk high tier skins. The high tier skins are going for so much more overpay than they should be. 
but the lower end of things on the lowest tier of skins all the way up to mid tier to semi really decent looking skins are going for cheaper because so many are being pulled your pinks your purples there's so many people opening cases right now that the market is getting flooded with these skins so if there's a pink or a purple or even some of the reds that you really really want i would get it while the getting's good while there are so while there's millions of people opening cases while there's just hundreds of thousands of items getting added so that's just my take on things. I hope you guys really, really enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that thumbs up. Also, if you, if you enjoy my type of content, then go ahead and subscribe. I'm posting daily CSGO skin content. So I just, I really hope you guys enjoy what I'm doing here. I'm going to tell you again, don't stress about this. Your inventory is going to be okay. Your skins, their market, everything is going to stabilize out. I can promise you that. All right, guys. Stay safe and have a great rest of your day.